A multi-dimensional array is an array in which you can store other arrays. It is very similar to an associative array. However, the associates for this array are arrays themselves. For a better understanding, let us start the program. I will create a program that lets you see the position of a letter in the English alphabet. For example, if I give the value 1, it should echo out A in position 1. If I give the value 2, it should say B in position 2. And for 3, it will say C is in position 3 and so on. First, I will create my own array. And just for easy viewing, I will bring this down. You are quite welcome to do so yourself. And inside, I will create my own array, which I will call ABC. That will be the array. Instead of putting a value here, as we did before, we have an array itself. And inside this will be our values. For example, capital A, B, C, and D. And these values will be separated by commas. And then we type 1, 2, 3, and that is equal to an array. Now we are just going to have 1, 2, 3, 4, and that's it. Down here, I'll show you how to echo out specific data inside the array. We'll call our main array and we'll call this array as well. And then the position of what you want inside the array. So, it is an array inside an array. So, I'll just type echo and then alpha, which is our main array. And then inside square brackets, a, b, c. And next, inside square brackets, the position of the element that we want to retrieve. Not, for example, is going to echo A. Let's just give that a run. And we got A. Changing this to 1, 2, 3 will hopefully give us 1 as you can see here. So we've made our two basic arrays inside our main array and we've learned to call it. Now I'm going to create a new program to find out the position of a letter in relation to its number. I'm going to type up here position equals zero. since zero is the beginning. Now I will echo out letter something is in position something. This is going to be quite simple. We enter a position here, say three. Since C is in position three in the alphabet, we get C. So, to echo out our letter, I am going to replace the first blank with alpha. A, B, C, pause, as pause represents position. So then, the position will be alpha, 1, 2, 3, and then the position, pause. At the moment, position is equal to 0. We type echo something. So this is position 0. Position 0 inside the internal array ABC. So in actual fact, we are saying that A is in position 0. Which is this array 1, 2, 3 and that is position 0. So actually we are saying letter A is in position 1. Let's run this. Okay. So A 
is in position 1. Let's change this to 1. Refresh. Letter B is in position 2. Now, what I will do to make this application fully functional and easy to navigate is eliminate the necessity to write 0 for 1. So, I will put minus 1 at the end and put 1 in brackets for better legibility. So, position 1 minus 1 is in fact 0. So, writing 1 will give the same result as writing 0. And writing 2 will give the same result as writing 1. Letter B is in position 2. If I put 1, then we get A is in position 1. So, if I put 0 here, there is no position minus 1. So, we get letter in position. So, we don't have the letter or the position. So, I have made that a bit more user friendly. Thanks for watching.